grows, must also wither and die. What dies and rots will then nourish the living. This is the great cycle of being, and we, the priests of Rathma, use our dark art to protect it. Though most do not understand us, we go where we are needed. My master has learned that a star fell in the west, drawing the dead from their graves. He commands me to journey to Tristram and return them to their rest. For if the cycle is not upheld, it would mean the end of all things. shall appear in the heavens. Justice shall fall upon the world of men. The armies of light and shadow will clash across the fields of eternity. translations are correct, <coughs> the powers of hell could already be on the move. The world must be told of the coming darkness. You do believe me, don't you, Leah? I am near the fallen star, and the dead it raised. I have come to aid these lands. Where is the fallen star? It fell on the old cathedral. There was only one survivor, Leah. You should speak with her. Captain Rumford, more dead are coming. We can't open the gates until we drive them back. 
They keep coming! My power has... I've never seen anyone fight like that before. Guards, open the gates! You'll find Leah at the Slaughtered Calf Inn. Burn those corpses before they rise again. I came here to study the fall of old Tristram. This is closer to the town's history than I want to be. Zachary. As the shepherd watches over his flock, so shall I care for those who seek to protect us. I worked my hands to the bone to bring you these fine goods. Are you Leah? Did you survive the Fallen Star? I did, but it blasted my uncle Deckard Cain into the depths of the old cathedral. I tried to search for him, but the dead were already rising. I came back here to rally the militia, but... The Watch out! The wounded are turning! This is killing business. The dead will overwhelm us all, unless something is done. Yes, that is why I am here. Thank you. You should speak with Captain Rumford at the gate. He can tell you what to do. I don't care what anyone says. That thing that fell from the sky was no rock. A rock doesn't cause the dead to leave their graves. Have you come to help us? The other adventurers who came through... Welcome to the Slaughtered Cafe. Bring me whatever treasures you have no use for. I'll give you... We've been under siege for six days now. Uncle Deckard is still missing. Captain Rumford and the others are losing hope. I tell them not to lose faith. But if help doesn't arrive soon... Have you come to help us? The other adventurers who came through here didn't look so deadly. Tristram used to be such a wonderful place to live. My family has been here since the town grew out of the ruins of old Tristram. But now, it's horrible. The loved ones we've buried and grieved over now threaten our lives. Your cart is in the way. How dare you speak to me like that? I am the mayor of this town. Then why are you standing here, idle? Are you mad? This town is doomed. Anyone with a grain of sense should be trying to get out. Will you help me or not? No. Don't you dare lift a finger to help our mayor fix his wagon. I promised Marco I'd protect him, and now he's dead. Nothing ever seems to change in New Tristram, does it? Why do you say that? There's always some threat of the risen dead or foul evil descending on the town, isn't there? The militiamen went out. Only Rumford came back. How could that help us? We never should have built on this cursed ground. Maybe Cain was right. Even in death, Diablo torments us. I will bring peace to the risen dead. I admire your courage, but Captain Dalton and the militia were slaughtered by those things. Only I survived. I have experience in these matters. Well, I have seen you fight. Strike at the wretched mothers and their queen. They're the ones vomiting out these horrors. They're attacking the barricade! There. That's one of the wretched mothers. There are more of them in the ruins down the road. I, Deckard Cain, have spent many years traveling and writing about the strange creatures in our world. But the sight of the wretched mothers still haunts me. They are the remnants of Queen Asilla's slaughtered handmaidens who were twisted by foul magic. 
Now they feast upon cadavers and regurgitate them as newly formed, risen dead. I will never forget the first time I saw these horrors shambling out of the misty woods. Our loved ones, buried long ago, rose from their graves and began to attack the living. However, the risen dead were only the beginning. Dear reader, I am Abdal Hazir, adventurer, scholar, and researcher. I share my knowledge of this incredible world and its creatures through my insightful missives, often at grave risk to myself. Why, I was recently in Kanduras, where my tents were... I have trained well. It is done. That foe will die. During the last days of King Leoric's reign, even the skeletons of the ancient dead could not rest. They took up their broken armor and weapons once more, ready to cut down anything that yet drew breath. Though wasted and fragile, these creatures possess a twisted cleverness that makes them
Old Tristram. Diablo once walked these lands. Thank you for your help, but could you talk some sense into Leah? She won't give up on the idea of rescuing her uncle. Interesting. If he lives, his knowledge could prove useful. I have long waited for this knowledge. I will help you find your uncle, Leah. We'll need to open the cathedral first. The guards locked it up before they were ambushed. Rumford told me they fought their way back to Adria's hut. The key must still be there. Some heroes are fighting each other in an area near here. Wanna go? Oh, and uh, you didn't hear about it from me. <laughs> Afraid of damaging your armor or weapons? Huh, that won't happen over there. In fact, no one even dies. Disappointing, really. Strike true. I heard the people who left to get help have all died. It doesn't seem likely the Deckard King could have survived down in the cathedral this long, does it? Strange things happen in these lands. You seem quite sure of yourself. Do you know something I don't? <laughs> 